Welcome to Stockholm School of Economics, or in Swedish, Handelshögskolan. Congratulations on being admitted to one of our bachelor programs. We're looking forward to meeting you here in August. To help you along the way, we would like to share a few steps to help to prepare for your new life and studies here in Stockholm. Housing is a hot topic in all big cities. We have a small number of apartments that we offer for our incoming international students. Information about the application process will be sent out in early spring. Information about rent, location and the lease agreement will be stated in the application form. Please visit our housing page where we have gathered tips and advice. We are looking forward to seeing you here in Stockholm and at SEC. Non-EU citizens are required to obtain a residence permit to study in Sweden. To do this, you need to go online at the Swedish Migration Agency and apply. Then you will have to visit the nearest Swedish consulate or Swedish embassy to be photographed and fingerprinted. Please bring with you a valid passport, your acceptance letter from SSE, proof that you are able to support yourself while you're studying in Sweden, as well as partial payment of your tuition. For those of you who plan to stay on after your residence permit expires, you are able to extend your residence permit to seek employment in Sweden and or start your own business. Estimating the cost of living is always a tricky thing when you move to a new city. We have prepared a few rough estimates for you. They include housing, food, insurance, hobbies, and public transportation. You will need a Swedish home insurance in order to rent an apartment. Remember to tell people you are a student because there are discounts for students at many places, such as the gym or when you buy a transportation card. These figures are rough estimates and they depend on your preferences and your budget. In mid-August, we have mandatory introduction days for you. During these days, you'll be able to meet SSE's management team, the professional service units, SASE, the student association, the program directors, and their team. Don't worry, we also have a lot of fun activities planned. You'll be able to meet with your new fellow classmates, but also other new students at the school. We hope that these days will create a positive atmosphere for your next studies at SSE. Make sure to sign up to our course Welcome to Swedish before the actual program starts. It's a great way to get a taste of the Swedish language and culture. We also offer a preparatory course in mathematics in August. It's a great way to brushen up on your math skills and also to get to know the premises and your fellow classmates. Read more about the Swedish course, the math course and of course the introduction week on our web. You should apply for a Swedish personal identity number when you arrive in Sweden. This is done through the Swedish tax agency. Having a personal number will allow you to have access to the Swedish healthcare system, open up a bank account, have your own phone plan, rent an apartment, pretty much anything that you need to have an everyday life for living in Sweden. At SSE, we offer Swedish courses for any student who wants to take them. They're free of charge, but you don't need to take them because, of course, all of our programs are offered in English, both as a language of instruction and as a language of administration. However, a lot of us feel that you have a richer experience here in Stockholm, living and learning, if you have a little bit of a feel for the local language. So we have a progression of courses that will take you through three levels. And at the end of those three levels, you'll be able to converse, you'll be able to understand what's going on around you, be able to follow the local news and things like that. In addition, it's a little bit of a step forward for those of you who discover that it's interesting to look for your first job here in Sweden. Three levels, free of charge, open for you if you want them. If you have been conditionally admitted, you need to submit your final transcripts as soon as you have graduated. You submit those to your account with universityadmissions.se. 
As soon as you have done so, we can make sure you still fulfill our requirements. If you have any questions about this, don't hesitate to contact me or my colleagues in the admissions team. Stockholm is considered to be the cleanest city in Europe and it's also ranked as one of the most innovative and sustainable cities in the world. The atmosphere is very open, inclusive and welcoming and the Swedish population is considered to be maybe a bit shy or reserved in the beginning but once you get to know them they are incredibly friendly, helpful, respectful and not only does the majority of the Swedish population speak English fluently, they also enjoy it. So this is my favorite place in Stockholm. No, this is my favorite place in Stockholm. We are now in the old town, Gamla Storn. You can see lots of colored houses, beautiful houses here on this particular island, including many cozy coffee houses, restaurants, bars, and the Nobel Museum. No, actually, this is my favorite place in Stockholm. And I'm not gonna tell you where we are right now, but what I can tell you is that many locals and quite a few tourists come here to take pictures of the skyline. They have a Swedish fika here or they just enjoy the evening sun. To sum up, Stockholm is a fantastic study destination. Sweden is a strong promoter of gender equality. We live and encourage diversity, sustainability and innovation and are proud to rank highly in the Good Country Index year after year. We can almost guarantee you that you will be blown away by the beauty and the opportunities that Stockholm has to offer. So if you're not already from here, from Stockholm, then I would recommend you to visit the website visitstockholm.com to find out more about your new home. And I would say hey do and see you in August. Thank you for watching this video and I hope that you have learned a lot of new information for your upcoming studies. We have created a new student page where you can find all this information and more. As always, you can contact us and even chat with our students via UniBuddy. We look forward to welcome you on campus in August. Hej